Hi Libra, welcome to your reading. My name is Samantha um, on my channel. I just post spiritual content. I post spoken word, readings, anything having to do with healing, um, prophetic messages that I receive from God, the divine. The readings are to be used as a guide. I am not here to give you all the answers. I'm not gonna be telling you anything you don't already know. I'm just gonna be validating experiences that you are currently experiencing. And I will not contribute to anybody consistently staying in a karmic cycle. I will not con contribute to the drama. Um, I will give you messages from the divine, which are of peace, of comfort, of love, of support, and um, drama free. See what is coming through for my Libras. And this is for Libra in any placement. However, Libra resonates for you in your birth chart. Um, so thank you, God, angels, guides, ancestors, and God's warm white light. Thank you for helping me to give Libra the messages of the highest good. Amen. All right. So let's see what's up for my Libras. One card, please. What do you want them to know? King of Pentacles to start off. All right overcoming also it's like overcoming but overwhelming interesting also seed something about a seed seed is planted or seed is is seed is planted tell me more about this king of pentacles eight of pentacles Some of you actually could be coming into some sort of promotion. Now, when I say promotion, um, it could be talking about like just like the next level in your work, whatever line of work you are in. Um, I am seeing like a level up in your career. So three of swords though, three of swords. This has been taking a long time. Let's just put it that way. I feel like you've went through a lot of financial hardship. Um, your reading is very finance focused. You've went through a lot of financial hardship. Some of you actually might've been through a divorce that caught, that brought on a lot of financial hardship. Um, and um, I'm seeing that you're finally going to start getting ahead financially. If that's been something that you've been really just, just praying for and wanting to at least to just get ahead. I'm definitely seeing that for you, for my Libras. What else do you want Libra to know? I'm hearing dad. So, something about a dad is coming through. Left unsaid. Hmm. Also, um, trigger warning suicide is coming through as well. So this will not be for everybody, but there is somewhat of a okay there's there's a father figure that is passed on that's coming through to um to i'm um, feeling his daughter his daughter i'm seeing a th name a th name um this is really unexpected and he wants you to know that he knows things were left unsaid between you but that he knows what you would have said, that things were not left actually left unsaid. He, he knows everything you're thinking about him. He knows everything you're saying to him. He knows that he says, I'm sorry. He definitely took his life in some way, um, validated by the magician, which the magician is like your own power, your own will. Um, He's saying life was just so tough for him. Life was really tough for him. And he just couldn't. He was, oh my gosh. I just heard I was feeling froggy, so I jumped. But it's like he said it with somewhat of a sense of humor. And that might not be funny to you. But he said it with a sense of humor to kind of show like, like I'm okay. I'm okay. Like I'm good. I'm 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 at peace. I'm at more peace than I could have been. Um, he 
He wants you to know that he's there with you, that he's here, like he's, he's with you and, and he did not leave you. Um, he will not leave you and he's actually signed on, on to be a guide of yours. Um, he's saying that he, he's actually going to be like the best guide ever. Like I see him being like, um, uh, dressed up in like a wilderness, like a wilderness guide, um, like on a trail, like, <laughs> like, um, what do they call those wilderness, um, guides? Yeah. Like on a trail. Like I see him being like that for you. And, um, he's like, I'm going to be her guide. Like. I'm ready to be her guide. I feel like, like, I feel confident in this position. Um, he can guide you more where he's at than he could have in his physical body, he says. He he wants you to know that he's, like, in his full freedom and capacity. Like, he has no limits now. And um, I don't know if he had limits. I'm hearing limiting beliefs. He had limiting beliefs here that kept him from living out his purpose and kept him from fulfilling what he could have here. But he signed on to be your guide, to guide you through this tough time, and to guide you to having better than he did. So that's what he wants you to know, who this is for. I'm also seeing thorns. I'm seeing thorns around a heart. Um, I, I don't feel like your relationship was the best in the physical realm. I definitely don't feel like your, your relationship was the best. And so it might seem surprising to you that he wants to be your guide, but he's letting you know that he's always loved you. He just had issues. He had issues that he just had such trouble overcoming because of his own limiting beliefs and, and his own limit limits. And he just couldn't overcome them. And he, he tried and he tried and he just one day just felt so down that he just took his life. Um, but how spirit works is they alchemize, they take, they take darkness, they take, you know, hurt, pain, all of that suffering, and they turn it into beauty. They turn it into being useful. And so that's what they did with him in his situation. Yes, he took his life, but he, spirit wanted to use this to alchemize him to alchemize his purpose and to put him to use in a way that he felt was more serving. And that was to be your guide. Wow. And, and so he's letting you know that spirit's going to do the same for you. They're going to alchemize your pain and your suffering and your loss and your, your confusion and turn it into the most beautiful um, transformation possible. So your dad is with you. Talk to him. He's with you. Your relationship will not be as strained as it was here. It'll be very pure and helpful. Um, so he wants you to know that. Also, something about drug abuse is coming through. Something about alcoholism. Some sort of, um, like, just abuse of some kind when it comes to substances. So I'm going to leave that there. Whoever that was for, please, if you feel comfortable, leave in the comments who that was for. That came through so clearly. Thank you, dad. I'm going to close the portal and send you back with your daughter now. Thank you. Okay. So for Libra, we got growth. We got expansion. So talking more about your promotion and your um, career and you're reaching the next level in your success. However, whatever that means for you, pr primarily your money. Your money is going to the next level. Progress. Yeah, Six of Swords talks about transition. So if you've been looking for a new job or a new position, something that makes you more money, you're about to get it. That's what Spirit wants you to know. Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles is abundant. She, she got everything she needs. Um, no more having to walk on eggshells is what I'm hearing as well. Some of you might be in a work situation where you feel like you have to walk on eggshells. I don't see that being a reality anymore. You're about to be done with that. Yeah. Two of wands and justice. You're just waiting on the perfect opportunity and you're about to get the justice you deserve. Yes. Stable opportunity. All right, Libra. I think that's all I have for you guys. The world completion new phase, new adventure. 
So um, I wish you guys the best. If you need a personal reading, I'll leave that in the description box or a healing. And I will see you guys next time.